Melissa Hager TV. Hi, been a while, guys. I'm so pumped. Look at Lori and Karen are here. The moms, yay! That means <laughs> we're talking Greta Van Fleet today. Woohoo! Woo! Guys, it's been a while. Make us talk about our boys. Ben, oh. <laughs> I love if guys. we must. <laughs> Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> They're coming to Michigan. Yes! Finally. Yay! Yeah. Finally. It's yeah. been years. How Greatly fun. anticipated. I know. It has been years. Literally. Yeah. It has years. been. Yeah. They wow. They kept promising and they're delivering. The, yeah, they kept trying and it, this this thing got in the way and that thing got yep. in the way. and So they're calling this the, the Dreams and Gold Tour. Yeah. I'm excited. Are you guys wearing gold? Oh, oh, have to you know, I, don't, I don't look good in gold. I don't, I, I don't know, own any gold. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you Maybe both look good in white everything. Gold. I'll do white gold. <laughs> white gold. All right, white gold. I, I weirdly ordered a couple like gold jackets. Of and course I'm like, you did. Yeah, I know. Nice. Of course you did. We'll see. I don't love gold either. I'll, but I've been watching the fan pages. Everybody's posting their outfits. Oh, my goodness. People. We're going to see a lot of those gold lame yeah. pants. Yeah. Totally, totally. <laughs> There's these people. Our fans are so creative. Mm -hmm. These jeans that they're making, uh -huh. and these shirts that they're making, and jackets. And I'm like headpieces. Uh, I can't even yeah. draw stick people. <laughs> yeah, I couldn't make something like that. To, where if I if I wore something I made, uh -huh. I'd get arrested. Be, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it would all fall apart. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I swear. That's funny. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, so I wouldn't even attempt it. No talent here. No, me neither. <laughs> uh, you know, so everyone would probably assume, you know, you're the moms. You rank highest on the list. Are you guys going to get some one-on-one -on -one time with the boys while they're here? Oh, I hope so. Maybe. <laughs> I know. It's probably it's a, a tough You know, call. it's a hit and miss. We yeah. can't tell. Everyone flies by the seat of their pants, I'm guessing. <laughs> yeah. It's like it's going to be crazy. Yeah, it will be crazy. Crazy. So is there, is there any one town you're most excited about? No, I'm actually excited about all of them. Um, I have different people right. that I know that will be in different venues, so yep. it'll be Us it'll too. be great. One actually, one that I am very excited about that we had discussed earlier is the Dow Event Center. Yes, in Saginaw. Because because the I just boys, got chills. Oh. The boys had actually opened uh, for um, Bob Seeger there back. A couple yeah, years, couple ago. years ago now, and it was such it was so huge. It was such a huge thing. It was a big mm -hmm. deal. Open for Bob Frick, and, and they Cedar. were so nervous, and they were so, so nervous, nervous and so excited. And now they're actually it's their own headlining. show. They're they're headlining their own show at and that it's sold Calvin. out sold in out like the forty Dow. minutes. Yeah. I mean, fast. Yeah. They were done, and it's our so backyard. That one's, it's, yeah. yeah, it's basically our backyard, yeah. kind of you the know? hometown stadium. Yeah. So I am know? excited for all of them, and they'll yep. all be fantastic. Yep, they're all but be that awesome. one has just a little extra. There's gonna be a lot of Frankenmuth people there. There's yes, just gonna there be, will be. It's mm -hmm. gonna be a really fun show. Mm -hmm. I know, and one of the shows is on St. Patrick's Day. Yes, Ypsilanti. Yeah, so we'll be having some fun there. Right? We'll be wearing green. Yeah. <laughs> yes, we will. And yes, we will. And gold. Yes, we will be. <laughs> of course. <laughs> and the gold. Why not? Why not? Uh, for those of you that don't know, we haven't talked about it a whole lot. Uh, Aunt Mel, w which you guys have so graciously <laughs> grabbed a hold of and ran with like crazy people. Um, and we'll be at every show outside, so I'm really excited. We're going to get to do some special, fun things with you guys outside in the line before the doors open. So make sure you watch for me somewhere and get on camera with me because I would love to be able to talk to you you, I would love to be able to talk to you, and uh, I just don't think I'm going to be able to. I want to see a Greta Van Fleet wave. A, a Greta yeah. Van, Van. Oh, Fleet. Oh, that would be fun. We could do that. Greta Van, Van Fleet. Fleet. I think that would be fun. <laughs> okay, well we're doing there that, we go. guys. We gotta we for the moms. We gotta do that. <laughs> we don't ask for much. Yeah, no, you really don't. You really don't. Um, so we're we got through the holidays. That was kind of crazy with all this mess going on, and and now we're gonna get back into the concerts. Are you ready? I mean, you guys were. It was happening like all the time, all the time, and then we've had such a Stop. long break. Yeah. yeah, with like these little concerts here and here and here. And and it is interesting because because of that break, I, and the boys have gotten to do a lot of growing and had a lot of uh, time to get in their heads and think mm -hmm. about where they're and what they're doing and all that. But we've also had more of an opportunity to spend time with them because when they were on 
tour. It was such a crazy time. They're busy constantly. Mm-hmm. Um, so it is going to be a little more yeah. getting used to have less access. And, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because they'll be but, traveling again. But they're super excited. They are, they are so, so excited. They are so excited to be back. That's so great. So yeah. excited. Yeah. That's great. They do. They they come alive on stage. They really do. Each each one of them has such a big part of the concert and how it feels while they're up there, and it's so magical. And all of us are the anticipation is just like through the freaking roof. Yeah. We just can't yeah. wait. It's yeah. gonna be awesome. Yeah. And they've, I mean. Through all this, I'm sure they've gotten time in the studio to do some practicing and and do yep. some different. Oh yeah, they've oh, been writing. Yeah. They've been yep. working on the next album. Working hard. Uh, they've yeah, that's awesome. They've spent a lot of time in, out in the boondocks. Out in the boondocks. In the, in the mountains together. Just doing their thing. What could go wrong? So what could go wrong? Right. What could? <laughs> well, let's not. <laughs> Knock on wood. That's right. We're good. Um, so th- we got five shows happening in Michigan, Kalamazoo, Grand Rapids, uh, Flint, Saginaw, and Ypsilanti. Yes. Right? Yep. Good job. Yeah. Yep. Um, they all sold out. Yep. All the shows sold out. There's not a ticket to be found unless nope. you go to a scalper, which you're going to pay a ridiculous I'm going to like don't for. Go to don't go to yeah, scalpers. Don't. And, it's, and, it's, and be careful on yeah, sites. Risky. Yes. It's very risky. We've heard of lots of people getting fake. Fake yes, tickets. fake tickets. Um, did I mean they're ping ponging around our state, our home state, where they're from? Sold out five shows. Did you ever see this coming? You hope. You know, we like it's it's like we envisioned it. Like it's in, a dream. It's like this is the goal, and this is someday. Ooh, someday this will be wonderful. Someday, but. I, I think didn't we even... believed. I think we believed it in our hearts that like someday they'll they'll make it and they'll be you know doing touring and doing this stuff. But I don't think in the moment I never had a chance to really envision what that would look like or what that would be. Even when they opened for Bob Seger, I couldn't even picture them as a headliner at the Dow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 It was like someday, Bob was someday, the headliner. Be so someday cool. 10, 15 years yeah. down the road. Mm-hmm. Yeah, not. Just now, a couple, couple well, yeah, years I was say down it was the road, three and a half. I yeah. mean, it hasn't even yeah. been that. And long. that was like no music for uh-huh. two years because of COVID, too. Yeah. So exactly, yeah. exactly. It was. Uh, so. It's pretty. Yeah, pretty magical. Yeah. Well, and you guys actually, before we forget, we should let the fans know too. As of right now, and this is a Live Nation requirement that you bring your vaccination card to the concert. Or a negative COVID test, correct? Yes. So we should make sure we help spread that word. If you're bringing friends with you, you know people that are coming, you're in one of the fan groups, help spread the word. As of right now, that's Live Nation's policy. And, and I haven't heard much about it, so I think it's good that we make yeah. sure everybody knows yeah. that stuff. And, and, and who knows, that might be changing, but as of now, yes. I verified it yesterday, as mm-hmm. of now. That's mm-hmm. yep. definitely the case. Yeah, and we're only we're we we don't have that much time no, to go. So. Only a month away. So be prepared. Oh, don't want to be turned away at the door. Uh, yeah, no. that would be awful. If you could have avoided it. Yes. Yep. Yeah. That will be awful. I can't wait. I know that there's some meetups uh going on. Uh the Greta Van Fleet fans getting together. They're raising some money for some great causes. Yay! Yes, they're awesome. Thank going you, thank out of you. their way without any of our involvement, any of the boys' involvement, stuff they're doing on their own. I believe um, they're going to be reaching out and giving some money to Hurley, one of our great, yep. awesome places. It's been where Danny was born. That's yes. so cool. We, we love that. And I, you guys are awesome. You're awesome. And that week is going to be crazy. So, uh, you know, now would be the chance for you guys to say something to the fans because there's no way you're going to possibly be able to talk to every single one of them in that time. And even though everyone, including myself, is going to be wanting to super fan both of you uh, in the excitement, like you birthed them. You guys so birthed weird. you guys birthed the rock band for <laughs> heaven's sakes, you know. So if if. If they were standing in front of you right now, what is what would you say to the fans of Greta Van Fleet? I think I'd just start with thank you. Thanks for, you know, being such great supporters, uh, buying into the whole message of, of peace, love, unity. Uh, the, the, the way you raise money, you have these events and you raise money for these charities. And uh, just thanks for being such great fans, so supportive. Um, and thanks for having our boys' backs. You know, there's a lot of uh, 
ugliness Mm -hmm. out in the world and there's a lot of haters and there's a lot of people that don't want to see our boy succeed. Which is why I stay off socials. Yes. (laughs) Sorry. And years and years ago... We never had to worry about this stuff. And if we something came up, we had to take care of it. But now yeah. we know all of you wonderful, wonderful, good-hearted people have their backs. And thank you because it takes a village and a half mm-hmm. to get rid of the haters and yeah. all the sadness that people want to see these boys fail. So your hearts are loved and appreciated and we cannot thank you enough for being who you are. Oh, we're that's so proud so that we have the fans mm-hmm. like we do. Mm-hmm. Other and they people. do oh, they come in and droves. I'm going to just say this thing. So I was at the Atlanta show um, where they uh, opened for Metallica. Yes. And I was, you know, backstage there kind of hanging out and um some of the Metallica folks that the like a uh, road manager, tour mm-hmm. manager type, um, came walking through and was like, Holy crap. That, I don't think those were her words. I think she was a little more graphic. But you know, holy crap, those do you see those Greta fans? You see those guys are great. I can't even believe how great those Greta fans are. Look at them. And they went on and on, like three different times through, talking about the Greta fans out there and how, you know, Metallica has this incredibly wonderful fan base themselves. And to see that the Greta fans were contending and the Greta was just an opener, I was really I was really proud of Aww. all of our all yeah. of our wonderful fans mm-hmm. that, you know, that was so wonderful. Mm-hmm. We got a lot of Metallica fans mm-hmm. out of that. There yeah. was some They're really nice. great posts actually by um oh man, I'll have to look it up. So after that concert, one of the Metallica fans joined yes. the Peaceful Army yes. fan group. Remember yes. that? It was And he wonderful. posted the greatest, nicest, yes. most awesome, you sweetest message. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. yes, about yeah. his his euphoric feeling about the Greta Van Fleet fans and how everyone can come together as a family. And I, it was incredible. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. so cool. And that yeah. was neat, too. I mean, Metallica, you're talking about you know I, that's a band that's been around a very long, long time. time and and they're still and a up fan there base that huge and why can't for... you just all be together mm-hmm. and love yeah. music mm-hmm. you know why does there have to be a separation mm-hmm. right. just join mm-hmm. forces and yeah and that had to be really cool for metallica too if any of that stuff got up the ladder to metallica yeah, I know. Yeah. that that they were able to choose an opener based on whatever their criteria right. was that they but that it ended yeah. up being such a big bonus to re, re you know yep. unite the fans yes. yeah what a cool thing yeah yep. yeah so freaking cool. Especially yeah. with the years so. difference yeah. between the two fans. Yeah, totally. it's pretty neat. Totally. So oh. the dads, how are the dads feeling? Are they getting excited? Oh, yeah. The dads are the dads. Dads they, are the dads. They're just, they they're just, just like, coming along for the ride. Yeah. <laughs> they're proud. The dads are proud the dads. Proud papas just yeah. kind of doing their, yeah, we'll be there. Yeah. Good. Oh, yeah. Good. I like it. That's awesome. Well, we're really excited, and uh, we, I know I can't wait. I know you guys can't wait. I know... The moms can't wait. I wish we could all hang out every day that week, but I know it's just not going to happen. So this is me snagging them right now when I can get some time with them. And I and I I, I don't know. Are we going to see the the golden ticket fans? There was like a few fans from Michigan that got golden tickets, right? That could go to all the shows. Yeah, I'm not sure. Who I, got don't know who, I, I, don't I don't know. I don't know who got, got them. them but I don't. I know that the golden, nope. the golden ticket was. I saw. It. I good think for I saw, every show. Yeah, yeah I, so. I think I saw one person post. Okay. On Facebook, and that's it. That's that, pretty darn special. Yeah, that's yeah. a really special thing. I, I heard about cool. them. And I, I thought there were a couple. Yeah, I didn't yeah. know how many there were. I just remember seeing the yeah, one. Yeah, so. if you know anything to... about the Golden Ticket fans, we yeah. would love to hear about that. That, yes. that was a really neat thing. So we have a really fun thing. I'm, I'm glad you've stayed tuned until the very end because anyone that already left this video is going to miss, miss out. out. So we have two tickets to give away to one of the five concerts happening in Michigan. No. Oh, yeah. Totally. I have chills again. I know. How fun. So uh, what we it will be at total random. So what we need you to do is comment which city you would like two tickets to for the Michigan Dreams and Gold Tour that's happening. So it will either be Kalamazoo. Grand Rapids, Flint, Saginaw, or Ypsilanti. And that starts with a Y. Yep, Ypsilanti. 
<laughs> just to be sure. Just to be sure. I went to a small school, so I don't always know how to spell. Um, but uh, one city, comment once, comment one city. Obviously, we love your feedback. We love your questions. We love talking to you. So you're welcome to comment other things in general about the video. But if you want a chance at winning those two tickets to one of the cities, we are not going to tell you which city we're giving two tickets away to. Just comment, and by the first week of March, we will be giving those tickets away right here Yay. on Melissa Hager TV. So but you can only put one city. Yes. Don't be one of these that one submits five different cities. Yeah. Because then city. you're going to be taken out of the running. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You know, and One I saw this too, that there's a ton of people going to their very first ever Greta Van Fleet concert. They found Greta through COVID and all that isolation. Yep. They found their music. I mean, that's going to be an experience yeah. in itself. Yeah. Their very first concert. Because yeah, well, there isn't there isn't anything quite like this no. that will prepare you for a live Greta. The, no. the energy that flies. Mm-hmm. During the live performance mm -hmm. is just yep. mm -hmm. yep. indescribable. Just and I know crazy. a lot of young people coming for the first time, mm -hmm. which is really neat. We love, I mean, high school. Mm -hmm. yeah. I kids love with their it. parents. Yes, like, they're coming with their parents. Like even middle school kids with their parents. Yep. Yep. So yep. cool. Very, very neat. And what happens on that stage is magical. I mean, it really is what the four of them boys accomplished together. And I'm... A little partial to my Josh boy. I think that he is a really good performer, but, you know, I might play favorites once in a while, but that's it. <laughs> I think they're all great. They're all super great. So um, nobody has gotten any crazy haircuts or anything, right? We're not, we still get to see hair on yep. stage. We still get to, okay. Have you guys gotten a Unless look at? something changes between now and then. Yeah, yeah I have no idea. True. That's true. <laughs> you never know. That's true. You guys haven't gotten a glimpse at any of the outfits they're going to be wearing, have you? Seen some sketches. Oh, yeah. oh boy! I bet they're it's cool. It's top secret. Very yeah, cool. I bet. Top secret. Yes, I bet. Indeed. Is it different for every show? Do you know? I wonder if there'll be gold. Do you? <laughs> Hopefully, it's white gold. White gold. <laughs> Oh my gosh. You're going to be dripping. Dripping in dripping gold. Dripping in gold. Oh, it's going to be exciting. All right. Uh, well, you know by now they're already commenting their their cities that they want to go to. Yes. So write your comments down the first week of March. Make sure you check back at Melissa Hager TV. We will be posting our random winner to the random city. And uh, we will make sure to get your information and, and contact you on how to get your tickets. Sounds good. Girls. We'll it's see tour you soon. Time. How exciting. Tour yes, time. we're ready. Yes, indeed. We're ready. Thank you for coming in. I absolutely. Just, oh, absolutely. I love hanging out with you guys. You know. Yeah, I, I really we love do. To hang out with you. I know, but I like you guys more. <laughs> okay, put the Kleenex away. <laughs> this is supposed to be uplifting. <laughs> All right, guys, that's it for.